we built Temporal to simplify the process of building reliable and scalable applications. Over the next two minutes, we will explain what Temporal is all about. Temporal applications are written in plain old code using two types of special purpose functions, workflow and activity functions. Workflows are stateful functions used to orchestrate your application. This means all local variables and threads within a workflow are seamlessly and safely stored in the temporal service. If the underlying server crashes, Temporal resumes the workflow to the exact line it was running before the crash. You can safely write code that blocks for days, weeks, and even years, eliminating the need for additional queues and databases to track temporary state. It's sort of like going from manually saving in Microsoft Word to autosave in Google Docs, but for running applications. Pretty cool, right? The second building block of temporal applications are activities. Activity functions are used to encapsulate code that interacts with potentially unreliable services and can only be called within a workflow. If your activity fails because a service it depends on is down, it will be called again automatically without writing any custom retry logic. Activities are not stateful, but they do come with automatic retries, configurable timeouts, and they even support heartbeats. Temporal empowers developers to write highly reliable and scalable applications without needing to code around everything that will go wrong. It excels at orchestrating services, but is also great for data pipelines, resource provisioning, and much, much more. And the best part is that it's free and open source. Now that you know what Temporal is all about, it's time to start building some invincible applications. 